The running stitch is the most basic hand sewing stitch there is, and it's usually the first hand stitch that people learn to sew. So you start with the needle coming from behind your fabric. The basic motion of your needle is a wave motion, coming over the fabric and under the fabric. As you see I was struggling a little bit there, it's much more laborious to pull the needle through on every pass. If you simply guide your needle over and under a few stitches and finally pull the needle, needle through, it's a whole lot easier. Since this is just for our practice, I've pre-marked the muslin with dots spaced at 1 8 of an inch, so you get in the habit of making small, even stitches on your fabric. Remember that the smaller the stitching, the stronger your seams will be. I wouldn't recommend making your stitches any wider than an eighth of an inch if you will be using this stitch. At the end, you're going to tie it off by making a small knot by catching a small bit of the fabric, pulling it through, and then putting your needle through the loop. You're going to repeat this step once more just to secure the knot. So just to show you a little closer, take a small bit of the fabric, Pull, but not all the way through. Take the remaining loop and feed the needle through. And just clip the ends and then you're done. And that is the running stitch. So if you Make your keep your stitches small, secure the end and the beginning really well. It's actually a pretty effective stitch.